well, well, well. Nicole Collard, tied to a chair, needing to be rescued again. George! Don't just stand there. Untie me. You know, this is becoming a habit. Maybe you should seek help. Okay, okay. Seeing Nico again was a strange experience. She was more beautiful than I remembered. Not that I would have dared tell her so. Take a look at this, Nico. I found it under the stage. Face paints. Well done, George. Shall I paint your face like a tiger or maybe even a cute little bear? Some other time, I think, Nico. Hey, Nico, can you give me a hand here for a second? What do you want me to do, George? Take a hold of this and pull it when I say so. You are such a romantic. Hey, Nico, can you give me a hand here for a second? I'm not pulling it again. I've greased it this time. This time it'll work. Okay, I trust you. That's what a guy likes to hear. That's one way to crack a safe. You didn't say you were trying to crack my skull, too. Just the usual slight miscalculation. You know me, Nico. You wouldn't be you without it. We've a choice of down or down. You know, I've missed you. I've missed you, too. Well, that's settled then. Shall we go? So what's a slab of rock doing inside a column of strange power? And why couldn't I get it? Beats me. Uh, charisma? Watch it, fella. Mm, the bad news? Your attacker stole the crystal artifact and got away. That's not all the bad news, though, is it? Oh, don't be silly, George. Andre and I are just good friends. Very good friends. Oh, you don't change. No, you. We don't need this, Andre. You wouldn't get any of the locals driving up here. Oh. <laughs> good thinking, George. Not very subtle, but it worked. Hey, lady. Subtle costs extra. George, wait! You know, on our day, we're pretty damn good, Nico. Unbeatable, George. Nico, I want you to know, if anything happens to me... Yes? Uh, you can have my Tintin collection. Thanks, George. I'm so touched. Who is he, anyway? He's a pig, that's who he is. A cretin. An idiot. A smooth-faced, wooden-headed... Ah, the cop who locked you up. I have to hand it to him. He must have guts. And just what does that mean? Uh, uh, so, tell us about the fellas who beat you up, Andre. I'm worried they might have already killed Bruno. Well, let's hope he didn't tell him too much. You're all hot, George. By the way, have you and Labano... Have we what? Have you been doing that... stuff? What stuff? Boy-girl stuff. Oh, that stuff? Yeah, that stuff. Boy-girl stuff. That's what I said. Listen, George. Andre is a good friend. Yeah? So it's just a coincidence he's around again? He's an expert in ancient manuscripts. Who else was I going to call? Oh, what's wrong with the very old, very ugly experts you see all over the place? I was glad Nico was with me. Jeez, I thought you were Petra. Hmm. Often sneak up on girls like that, do you? Only blondes. So it's true. They do have more fun. Hang on to the wig and find out. You know, it's a tacky outfit, but you look okay in it. Oh, thanks. Some guys just know how to compliment a lady, I guess. Hey, Nico, can you do something with this lock? I don't have anything to open it. Where would you be without me, George? Nico, could you turn your back, please? You are joking. I know, but it's these shorts. Not very flattering. Oh, fine. Quickly, get it over and done with. There, changed. Oh, you look nice. I bet you say that to all the guards. I couldn't get through the narrow gap. Um, George, when I first knew you, that would have been no problem. Guess I must be carrying a little more muscle, huh? <laughs> yeah, the fat kind. Okay. Look, whatever I said about you in that wig, I apologize. Apology accepted. Phew. Won't make you any thinner, though. If the world ends when I press this, then I'm sorry for all the nasty things I've ever said about you. George, just get on with it. Okay, sorry. 
Well done, George. Let's go and rescue Bruno. Out of interest, what nasty things? Oh, you know, the usual. The usual? Go on. I'm going to head for Montfaucon to look for clues. Nico? You go without me, George. Andre and I will see if we can work out the exact location in Egypt. Right. Well, um, I'll see you soon then. Off you go, George. Not only that, they, uh, knighted me. What? Knighted, as in made me a knight. Extraordinary. That's how it felt. Did they do it with a sword? Yep. Whole shebang. Arise, Sir George. What do you think, Nico? I'm speechless. I guess if you and me were married, that'd make you a lady. Very funny. I'd forgotten just how beautiful Nico was. I wonder if we'll run into Petra, too. There's an expression on your face when you say that which I really don't like. Well, she is kind of... Think very carefully before you finish that sentence. Uh, a psychotic, scheming killer. Good. Just remember that. Tell me that wasn't the entrance ceiling behind us. But, Nico, it was. Just tell me. Hey, lucky that wasn't the entrance ceiling behind us. Or we could be entombed here for eternity. Thanks, George. By the way, have you got the torch? The flashlight? No, I thought you had it. No, we swapped on the plane. But then we swapped again in the truck. Aha, uh -huh. but we swapped again on the walk. Nico. You're right. Let's just feel our way around. Hey, what's this? Feels nice. George. Right, sorry. What twists somebody up into a psycho like Petra? Who cares? You think maybe with psychiatric help, Maybe... She's a fully functional killer and she loves it. You didn't see her luggage. She carries tools to dismantle people. Well, that doesn't mean she's a bad person. Yes, it does. Now shut up about her. Nico? Yes? Have you ever considered going blonde? George! Okay, okay. Forget I said it. There's a glow up ahead. This could be it. What if we don't succeed? Come on, George. It's only the future of the planet. Yeah, that's right. No big deal. Hey, Nico. How about that? He was a frail old man, George. Yeah, but he had a big stick. Nico, I've kind of gone off Petra. Seeing her cozying up to the Grand Master like that, that was just creepy. Glad you've seen the light, George. I guess you're right. I'll try and find a way out. You do that. And George. Yeah? If you see anything that looks like a bomb, stay away from it this time, okay? Gee, I'll try. Things are kind of desperate this time, huh? Yes. Yes, they are. George. I know. I know. We've got to go. You know, after a show like that, you are going to be one major pain in the ass. Nico! I thought you were dead. Can you still not tell a wig from the real thing? <laughs>